Okay, Save Readers, this is week three and uh, follow me Monday and we're gonna talk about Walgreens shopping today. Um, there's a lot of stuff to go over when it comes to shopping at Walgreens. It's a very confusing store. There's not only register awards, there's in-ad coupons, there's manufacturer coupons and I know getting them in the right order is confusing and just the store in general. So um, I'm gonna start first is just going over some tips. You actually might wanna just get a notepad and pin out because I'm serious, the store is confusing. Um, the first thing I want to talk about is register awards, and actually I don't have an example of a register award, but um, um, you'll get to see it when we go to Walgreens today. So anyway, a register award is a manufacturer coupon, and it prints out when you buy certain participating products at Walgreens. So for example, let's say um, this week the Ben Gay is on sale, and if you buy two, you get a $5 register award. Um, it prints out after you pay. And with that register award, you can pretty much use it on anything. I mean, it excludes like stamps and a few other things, but literally you can use it on anything in the store. It's a great item to stock up on diapers or milk, stuff that's hard to come by with coupons. Um, but the confusing part about a register award is it is a manufacturer coupon. So, all right, I just want to talk real quickly about coupon to item ratio. Um, Walgreens only allows you one manufacturer coupon per item purchased. And if you have a register award, that's considered a manufacturer coupon. So, you know, Walgreens requires a product to be attached to that coupon as well. Um, here's a quick example just to show you guys. If you have, if you're buying three of these products and you have a manufacturer coupon for each of them, that's totally fine. But what happens is when you go check out and want to use a register award on top of this purchase, the register award's going to be. So instead, you just need to add an inexpensive filler item. It could be, you know, a clearance item or um, just something. I mean, these were really cheap at Walgreens. Um, you know, something by the registers, just something to eat up that, you know, so you can use that register award. And um, it could be 25 cents, it can be a penny, it just has to be a product. All right, one more thing about register awards I want to go over because it's very confusing is you cannot chain the same register award deal. So let's say Glade candles have a register award on them. You go buy the Glade candle, fine, you get that register award. You can't go back and buy the Glade candle again and use that register award because an additional register award won't print out. You can chain different register award deals, and that's how you kind of roll deals, and you're able to spend uh, a, you know less out of pocket by rolling different register award deals. When I'm getting prepared to go to Walgreens, the first thing I do is I go on my wonderful site and I print out the Walgreens deal list. This is great to have on hand. I end up printing them all out, and usually I'll get a highlighter and maybe highlight the deals that you know I really want to get. But I like when I go to Walgreens to always have a plan A and a plan B because a lot of times, as you guys know, a lot of the stuff is out of stock. So, I mean, you kind of do have to have, you know, other items you might want to purchase that are free after register award or, you know, a good deal with coupons. So, and then the second thing I do after I print this out is I go through and look at the um, in-ad coupons that I want to clip. There's lots of in-ad coupons in Walgreens um, flyers and it makes way more sense to just go ahead and clip them because, I'm sorry, once you get in the store, it, is kind of, it just takes forever if you have to sit there and clip all the coupons. So I go ahead and I clip the ones I want, and then I put them in. I take this along, you can do an envelope, anything you want, and I put all my Walgreens, you know, store coupons and manufacturer coupons that go with the deals in here. That way I don't have to flip through my big old binder to get all the deals out. So um, that's what I do. And then the other thing I do bring along with me is I still bring my binder along. Now this is, you know, a preference. I just feel like, you know, there's so many clearance deals out there. It's, it's really, it stinks when you go there and you don't have your coupons, just in case you do come across something like that. Um, so we're gonna head out to Walgreens and um, we'll see you guys there. All right, you guys, I'm at Walgreens, one of my favorite stores. I got my coupon binder, and I also have um, this little thing where I've got all my Walgreens coupons and uh, deals for this week in my little list. So here we go. All right, guys, we are by the Ben Gay, which is um, on sale this week. It's two for five dollars, and then um, when you buy two, you get a five dollar register award. Well, it's actually right here, and it's really confusing when you're in the store because a lot of the times they don't mark the sale prices, and so it's showing eight ninety nine. But as advertised, it's the four ounce cream, and it shows the picture. So this is it. So, anyways, you can buy two of these, which will be ten dollars, and then um, two two dollar coupons, so minus four, so that's paying six dollars for two. And then you get back a five dollar register reward. So it's like getting these for um one dollar one dollar a piece. No, 50 cents each. Woo! Go. All right. All right, guys. <laughs> we are in the eye care section here. There's a um, $2 off Visine eye care coupon, and this is why it's really good to clip your a weekly in ad coupons before you come to Walgreens. That way you're, you're really organized and you can get in and out really fast. Um, this is off any Visine product, point five ounce or larger. And this coupon is the same. It's $2 off any 
any uh, 0.5 ounce or larger lysine product. And it's a manufacturer coupon, so you can stack both of these together. The best thing to do is look for something um, inexpensive. Obviously, if you're going to pick something that's like $6.99, you know, you're not going to, your savings aren't going to be as good. So go for something that's $3.99 right here, right here, and right here. And stacked with both coupons, you're getting that free. Um, and also, if you're getting two of these, which I have two uh, manufacturer's coupons, you only have to use one Walgreens and add coupon, and it will deduct $2.00 off both of them, so it'll deduct $4 total on your receipt. And the other thing to remember too is to always, since there is a penny the overage, since this is $3.99 and these will be um, $4, there's a cent there, and what happens is if you hand the manufacturer coupon over after the NAB coupon, it'll beep since the, because of that penny. So you always want to hand over this coupon first. All Walgreens store, I mean, no, all manufacturers coupons first and then the Walgreens store coupon. Sorry about that. So manufacturer and then store coupon. Manufacturer store coupon. That will really help you and your transaction will be a lot smoother. <laughs> All right, another tip I have for you guys is to look for these red signs throughout the store. Um, they advertise monthly register awards. This says um, buy $10 or more in Quaker products and get a $5 register award. It's a monthly deal. It also tells you the date at the bottom. So this is 927 through 1031. So just keep your eyes out. And obviously a lot of these products will go on sale. So right now these are two for $7. Not really gonna be a good deal after the register award, but I bet you um, during this month they will go on sale and they'll be a really good deal. So um, you know, stay tuned for those kind of deals and just be prepared and maybe write down the register awards. Another really great weekly and ad coupon is for um, two for $1 Campbell's soup. It can be tomato or chicken noodle. Um, tomato soups are uh, considered Campbell's cooking soups. And so with this coupon, this dollar off two Campbell's cooking soup coupon, any two, you can use it on these. So pair the NI coupon with this coupon and you're getting free soup. So I'm gonna get four. Okay, another great booklet I've talked about is the Nabisco $55 um, savings booklet. And inside is these dollar off two any, any two Nabisco um, cookies or crackers coupons, starting at four ounce. So the four ounce size is these sizes, actually this is five and so it's bigger. But um, you can use this on these, which is great, because these come out to you after the sale, which is free for $3, only 50 cents a box. And these are great to have on hand in the car or for the kids' lunches. So I'm gonna stock up. All right, so another thing to look for in the store is orange tag clearance. This is only 25 cents, was originally a dollar for a six pack of ramen. This is a great item to stock up on, and it was actually right in the center of the store, but these orange tags are all over the store, so keep your eyes wide open for those. <laughs> Another great deal is um, the Listerine Total Care right here, and the one liter, which is a huge bottle, is priced at $5.99. And um, in today's week, um, today's insert is a two dollar. Uh, today's insert, today's Walgreens ad is a two dollar in-app coupon for this, for the one liter or the whitening. And also, um, there's been various newspaper insert coupons with a two dollar off. So when you combine both of these, it ends up being well, $5.99 ends up being a dollar ninety-nine for the big bottle. That's a pretty good price for this. So. All right, the Johnson's Baby Powder is printing a $1 register reward with the purchase of one. And the best part is you can get the smallest little size. So if you come up, instead of getting this big size, you can actually get this size and it's priced at $1.29. So after purchasing it, you'll get back the dollar register reward, which makes it 29 cents. And these are great for little baby shower gift baskets. All right, another great book that I talked about is the Walgreens October coupon book and it's found by the weekly ads up in the front. Um, Inside, there's lots of great coupons, and the best part is, you know, if you find a clearance still, you can actually pair up a coupon with a clearance line. So, what I found here is the Sally Hershberger, another thing I cannot pronounce. Um, anyway, it's on clearance for $5.69. There's also one on clearance for $4.74. So, obviously, I'm going to choose that over the other one. And then you can pair them up with the um, $2 off Walgreens um, Sally Hershberger <laughs> coupon, which will make it. Um, 274, which is actually a really great price because the free retail value on this is um, almost 10 bucks. So I'm going to get two, and remember, I only have to use one of these coupons and it will still deduct four bucks. Another great thing to look for in the store is um, tear pad coupons, any kind of any kind of coupon that's laying around. But um, these are awesome to take. This like seriously helps you build up your coupon stash for free, and it, you know you can take a few. Obviously, you don't want to be like a coupon hoarder, but you know take two or three if you're really going to purchase them. And the, and the cool thing is too, you don't have to use these at Walgreens. That's another thing people get confused about. These do have a Walgreens logo, but they are a manufacturer coupon. I mean, obviously Walgreens wants you to use. Another great deal is with a five dollar Roke in-app coupon. Roke products are so pricey, but if you look really, really hard, you'll find a product that actually it's almost out of stock. This is $9.99 the exfoliating cleanser. You pair this coupon, get my hair in my face, with a $3 printable that's available on the rope site after you register. And you're getting this product for $1.99, a $10 product. Awesome.